What up, what up, what up, what up, what up, what up, world? It's your boy Amp Dog with another episode of Politicking. Want to thank everybody for tuning in, showing your love, and uh, make sure y'all hit that subscribe and like button, <clears throat> please. And uh, tell a friend, and tell a friend, Big Amp Dog said, What's the deal? And uh, today we got a story coming out of Orlando, Florida, um, where a Florida man used his phone to live stream on Facebook him attacking two Orlando police officers. Now, you got to watch the video. Um, so if y'all check this video out and y'all don't know what I'm talking about, go to Twitter and go find the video. I don't want to play it because he has some type of, sound like some R&B music or I don't know who it was, The Weeknd or somebody. I don't want to get copyrighted. Um, but anyway, this guy, William D., Mecklish, 27, 27, bruh, this dude in this picture right here, he 27, and, hey, buddy had a hard life, or he might be on drug, I don't know, 27, shit, black gonna crack, I guess black do crack when you smoke crack, I don't know, <laughs> because this nigga, what? Anyway, uh, this is a very serious topic. Um, he basically, from the video, he was, like, the cops were sitting there, and they, you could tell they, like, dealing with the, uh, uh, just probably just talking to an innocent bystander. And um, he he props the phone up on the sidewalk. And you see him kind of run up and creep behind the police car. And then that's when he comes from behind it with a brick. And then he just starts smack. Like, the first officer, I, I, he, I mean, he, you don't really got a chance because you don't see it coming. But if you could see, you could hear the impact of, of that brick hitting that man's face. Um, yeah, that's fucked up. Uh, the officer suffered a significant facial injury while a second officer who was there attempted to intervene was bit and nearly had his eye gouged out. Yes, he's on drugs for sure. This man was on drugs. No question about it. I'm not, I'm not even going, I mean, look at it. I mean, of course they put the, the lumps on his head. I mean, that's, I don't know what you was expecting, but the look in, like, just look at his, look at his face. William. And then you got that old ass name. What's his name? William. <laughs> hey, dog. Twenty seven, bro. That's crazy. Um, damn, that's crazy. So the one officer suffered a broken nose. Um, uh, the other one had his his eye damn near gouged out. Had his bicep and some fingers bitten. So this dude was crazy. Um, and you know, um. I don't know. That sucks. I mean, because you don't, nobody deserves that. I don't care if you feel some type of way about the police and them doing whatever. Not all officers are like that. You know what I'm saying? I could, I, I could attest to that as some good, cool ass officers. You know what I'm saying? I got family members that are like sheriffs and shit. And at the barbecue, I try to hide my little weed and shit, but then they be looking like, Nigga. you know, so some of them be cool. You feel me? But, um, you know, um, they're, 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 they're Look, one bad apple could spoil the bunch, but not that doesn't mean that every apple that's in that bunch is as rotten as, you know, the one that could spoil the bunch. Um, so I would say um, no matter how you feel about it, like stuff like this shouldn't be happening because then that only increases the tension between the community and police. So it's like either you want to fix the problem or you want to keep letting shit just go on. And I'm with fixing the problem, you feel me? Um McLish faces multiple charges, including attempted murder of a law enforcement officer, aggravated battery with a deadly weapon, and resisting arrest with violence. He's being held at Orange County Jail without bond. Um, and they say this is the second ambush attack on Orlando police officers. So either the police out there is doing some fuck shit, um, and people trying to get back at them or, or retaliating. I don't know if these officers are isolated incidents where they're being targeted by specific people that they probably didn't have interactions with but um yeah 
this just ain't, this is unacceptable, you feel me, like, and then you 27 out here looking like that, bro, man, last thing you need to be doing is trying to set up police and engage in any type of, last thing you need was them lumps on your fucking forehead, you didn't need them lumps on your forehead, bro, you already look old as fuck, with an old ass name, William, William, William. This got to be a typo. Ain't no way you fucking 27, bro. This shit got to be at least 45. At least. At least. I don't know, man. This is just a sad story. Y'all can go look up the video. I was going to play it, but like I said, he must have been twacked out because he was listening to The Weeknd or, or The Dream. He was listening to some soft-ass ballad, you know, some, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what he was on. Uh, hey, I hope the officers can recover. Um you know, cause you know, that it's just unfortunate and watching that video, it just seemed just real senseless, you know, and even in a moment where they probably had every right to, to do whatever they had to do to calm him down, whether it's, uh, less lethal force or even lethal, lethal force, um, they still, they still fought it out with him and, 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 you know, did what they had to do. So not all officers is, is, is the way that, you know, uh, it's being portrayed out in the media all the time, you know, as far as only time we hear about officers is if they make some fake ass post about them buying meals for the homeless or unless it's like them doing something, you know, it's never about, you know, um, bringing that, that police and community relations together, you know, so, uh, yeah. I don't know, man, it's, it's crazy, but I'm still, I don't know, maybe the story should have been 27 year old man looks 50 i don't know but i don't know y'all let me know what y'all think uh like share subscribe tell a friend tell a friend big m dog said what's the deal peace